Hello and welcome to a new video of PenPot, the open source design and prototyping tool for the whole team. We recently released uh, version 1.12 beta, one of the biggest releases we've done to date in terms of amount of functionality, enhancements, bug fixing, etc. So we are very proud about it. In this video we are going to review the most important features. So let's go. So first feature is adjustable interface. Now you can adjust the workspace interface to your personal taste. So you can resize the sidebar, layers panel, etc. You can hide it or even you can hide the whole UI in order to have maximum space. So along with a better organization with uh, all the panels and color palettes you can drag and drop it, recite them and say hello to the new typography toolbar. So from here you can uh, apply your uh, saved typography styles to, to your text. To continue, uh, we have guides, one of the most uh, community requested features. Uh, it's hard to believe that how far Penpot has come without guides, but, but they are here at least. So it's, a, it's an, we use we use the guides as a standard way. You drag and drop it from the top to bottom, from the left to side, and. Uh, they didn't come alone. They team up with the new ruler style. So if you select an item, you can highlight all the the whole area selected in the rulers. Scroll bars. Yes, they will ease and make more visible the navigation through the workspace. And if you do zoom in or zoom out, they will be adjustable. To your canvas. Are you using a graphic tablet? You will feel just as comfortable as those are preferring a mouse. And to finish we have the net amount. Uh, set your desired distance to move objects using the keyboard. You have two amounts, the small net amount and the big net amount. If you move with the keys or pressing shift plus the keys okay so this is a mask when you are working with grids it's amazing how big a time saver is to adjust that movement to your baseline grid 